in the week that we talked about um, the principles of assessment, um, we talked about validity, reliability, and fairness, um, and we were creating those um, questions um, and relating them to Bloom's taxonomy. So um, I created a couple of multiple choice questions and then a couple of open-ended questions because I find that mixing up um, different types of uh, assessment methods can touch on different aspects of Bloom's taxonomy. Um, so I just went into some detail and explained that. Um, and I think that it's important that we did talk about this because that makes us more aware on, you know, how, um, how we want our students to learn and how um, choosing different types of questions and even things I wouldn't have considered, you know, having the marking scheme that that can really, <clears throat> really impact how uh, the student is, you know, performs because I know that if I didn't know the marking scheme, I would be worried as well. But just little things like that to include um, being fair. Um, it's important, I think, when you're dealing with short answer questions to be fair because um, it's easy to be biased. Um, but um, the this week with the principles of assessment, it's really um, the lecture had really opened my eyes to um, how much thought goes into planning assessment and planning um, tests and things like that because it's not just a whole bunch of stuff thrown together and you know this is what we're evaluating on there's a lot of thought and um, time taken into that so I definitely learned a lot from um, from that lecture for sure